This is Rap the Nose. And I think this is around the sixth or seventh time I done did this video right here because I had to go back and edit it and go back and just redo it because I'm a little passionate about this. And then that passion to get me struck, you know, in this weak ass society. So what I'm a, what I'm doing in this video is going back and pointing out the things that people miss because if you saw it, you would have commented about it, you know. You would have put it in the comments of which you actually saw. So some of the main points of this video was missed. I believe that. And maybe you know the next time I will do the commentary on the video because maybe the average person is too busy to see. I don't know. Or maybe they don't see the same thing you're seeing. I don't know. But whatever it is, people miss the point. So we got the introduction with people who are thinking demonic, which is the what? The Grand Reaper, the the end time angel of death sticking his staff in the in the ground to mark the time of the Gentiles, right? That's what the intro is, and people saying that's demonic. No, that's straight scriptures right there. So let's get into it. This is Rap the News. Look at this. Look at this. In so we ain't going to let him do the commentary. We're going to do it now. So uh, what you see is sticks. And on top of those sticks is covers. Right? And I want you to see what they are doing. They ain't changed since 1590. They still the same mentally ill people. Right? Let's keep going. So you live in a stick huts. You and your children. It ain't just them. It's you, your wives, and your children with a little bit of food and everything else trying to maintain. And so you see the little children walking around with them. Now, what color is... Let's go back to the little children. What color is the children? What color are they? They are the dark ones. Notice in the encampment... You don't see too many light ones, even though light ones cross over the border with them. From Honduras, right? From Cuba, from all these other places. They, they passed over from Nicaragua, right? They passed over. Notice what you see in this entrapment right here is the darkies with the peasy hair. See, you notice that? And so these are the things that people was missing. Notice the trash, notice the blankets. Look, folks, this is out on the ground in Texas. There are rattlesnakes, scorpions, a hell of a lot of rats, rodents, and things that go bump in the damn night. You got mosquitoes. This is a bad situation getting worse, you know, and that's what these people are experiencing. And now we're going through the video. I'm doing the commentary now. And so, uh, with that said, we're going to keep moving on. And I I'm, I'm want you to see the trash and the condition of the people now. We got the dark one, and I'm saying this on purpose, because of what they are doing. With his dark child. Saying that, you know, I've seen people die on the way. You know, women that were pregnant was taken off into the, the water at night. The, 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 the water, uh, you know current took them away and, and people were dying left and right of starvation and different other, other ailments and so you gonna come here and then get abused too you went through all of that hell to get here and then still get abused when you get here yeah and it's because of your skin color he's pretty much saying the same thing he don't want to go back to Haiti because America killed the president they know who killed that president over there that was a hit from the Biden administration, right? You thought the Biden administration was going to help and they ain't doing nothing but doing what they always do. They got your vote and then they went against you. Now, let's read what it says. New images from inside migrant border facilities. Okay. And that's at 103, right? But outside is the darkies let's go to 103 inside 
is everybody that are lighter with straight hair. It wasn't a mistake. Either you're light or you got straight hair or you don't go on the inside. You stay outside with the darkies. This blatant racism. Now look, let's play a game. Find the dark one. Everybody light-skinned with straight hair that's on the inside of the migrant board. Same place. That's, that's why you're on the inside. We sleeping on the ground. Our babies is going through hell, crossing the river and everything else, right? But they on the inside. They got little toys and things that they could play with inside. They getting three square meals a day, right? They looking straight healthy, right? They getting processed. And then what they trying to do? Put you in the meat supply and throw you out? I don't care how dark the image is, the people are not dark. They're all the lighter ones. So what do they do? They separate the light ones from the dark ones. Now we get into the coyote part of it. Let's listen to this part. Because everything is fucked up. And then God is telling these people, and people ain't hearing me, however you treat Israel is how you're going to get treated. So I'm just making sure I'm still recording few minutes for us to start seeing migrant after migrant crossing. Here comes another raft across. Right. And here's another one. That's 31 right here. 31 in that group alone? Just in this group right here. So when they was coming over like this, was the Indians counting them? Was the Indians so fixated on what they were doing? Yeah, probably after they got murdered. Some of them young children. There's three children and the rest are adults. And you guys are seeing this all day. Probably. All day long. You can see the coyotes returning uh, to the Mexican side right now. And so let's, let, let's get on these GD coyotes. They some trick bagsters. Trick bagsters. They some trick bags. So um, here each individual is paying them seven thousand dollars per person even the children seven thousand dollars for them to lead them to the promised land america right okay now you didn't pay this man everything that you got and this coyote is going to take you down a pathway where he going to hook up with his buddies that paid him a little extra money so they can rape and rob you. I'll say that again. They getting paid on both plateaus. So they being paid by you, 7K a pop to come get you. And then when they lead you down this path to rape your ass, they get paid by them people to lead you down the path. They, they, and, and, and they might rape you themselves. It's, it's real ugly. There's a path down where they're going to kill and rob you, abuse you, and beat you. Right? Girls is getting gang raped by these rapists that's out there looking for young ass, boys and girls, and men and women. The coyotes led you. Look, they go through this path all the time. They know damn well where the rapists are. Why, did, why don't they go around them? They know damn well where the rapists are. They know where the damn robbers are, the banditos, huh? See the coyotes returning the uh, to the Mexican side right now. In just a few minutes that we've been again. up here, we've seen more than 60 migrants cross the border? That's correct. Yeah, and then if you drive over, I mean fly over fucking Hollywood, you're going to see thousands of you, and you cross the illegal yourself. A number of agents on horseback can be... And here go another incident. Now they got these long little whips that they gonna beat the slaves with. You know, they didn't, they minds that went back down to 1580. You know, and, and, and now they the overseers on the damn horses with their whips beating the runaway slaves. You don't think God finna take their asses off the set for this shit? This look, we are a test for these people. That's what's happening. And when God sum up 
how evil and wicked these people are, and they're wicked, he is going to burn, like we say, this mother down. Seen trying to keep migrants from crossing into the country while threatening them with what appears to be horses' reins. So they don't want to say a goddamn whip. They know what the hell these. They know what they. Or do. ropes, including families like this one holding a baby. And then you're gonna almost run over the little girl and shit. Because you're going through some fucking tyrants. When the agents get fucking dangerously oppressor. close, as they try to pass, the agent said this to them. Hey, you use your women? Is this why your country because you use And you sell your women in, in your states and for prostitution. A massive show of force by Texas troopers creating... All of these damn cops is creating a big, huge wall to block you out a barricade along the border to stop the thousands of mainly Haitian migrants from and it, it said pretty much it's thousands of cars at least hundreds but thousands of cars going down there in in a big barricade to block you out Lord knows what's happening to these people they're probably sniping them and doing all kind of shit just like my I'm arriving said. in Del Rio Texas this you and so just like I said again you got the dark ones on the outside and then you got the light ones on the inside. U.S. border facility appears more like an overcrowded daycare center. It's only supposed to hold 200. Look how calm they is. They ain't got to worry about the scorpions and the rats and the mosquitoes and the elements in the cold and the water and crossing over to get something to eat. They got they, they square meals people. going on. Overall, huh? there are more. They skin color got them passed, huh? Than 4, Everybody know this is injustice, man. Everybody know this is sick, man. Including 3,400 children smuggled to the U.S. border alone. I'm a father. How do you... Th You're a pervert. And an oppressor and an abuser. And he focused in, if we keep watching this, on the girl. Well, the girl got gang raped. Why is that so important to you? What you gonna do about it, bandito? Right? You got all these motherfuckers from the Honduras passing over what? And not the other. That's the way things are in our country. Yes, people are desperate. So they ain't got no people on horseback beating the shit out of them, do they? Where's the people out on? Look, look, look. You're crossing over from Honduras. Your skin color is a little lighter. Several hundred Hondurans set off on Tuesday, See? hoping to reach the what, United where's States. Where's the people on horseback beating you back? Of course I'm afraid. They say they're waiting. They said they're waiting down there with some tear gas. Lord have mercy. They're going to drive y'all to the damn facility on golf courts. Anyway, folks, um, this is what I say that people, uh, this is wrong. And people are being treated wrong. And I'm putting these videos out there. And, and, and here, here's the thing about America. Well, we can say how wrong the black man was. Look, he robbed and hurt that little white girl. And he needed to get the book thrown at him. It's good that they shot him 75 times. And then they can do whatever they want to to you. And then you're supposed to say, yeah, I understand why you guys are doing that. You got to understand why they're doing everything to you. I get that. Hey, look, no offense, buddy. You gotta, we have to be so understanding. Yeah, I understand. If I were you, I will probably... Do the same thing or even worse i mean look at look at us you know why shouldn't you abuse and oppress us this is some sick i mean this world is sick and so anyway like i said that that's why i wanted to go back over the video because if i look at the comments it seemed like most of the people is missing these important things that they still doing that the light-skinned ones going in the house with massa and the dark ones go outside in the field to bake out in the sun. They still doing that to the day. Let me go out there to the ones in the field and beat the snot out of them. And let me screw the ones in the house. And outside when the wifey leave. This is Raptor News.